Hello everybody, my name is Gaurav Gupta. I'm part of the product management team for Oracle Management Cloud. Today we'll be doing a quick demo on the cross-platform capability of Oracle Management Cloud. We have divided this demo into two parts. So in the first part, we would be covering the first two use cases, that's the complete application visibility and the early warning. And the rest of the three use cases, that's the early warning system component failure, business aware analytics, and the custom analytics and dashboard we would be covering in the second part. So let's start with the first two use cases. So first is how OMC provides the complete visibility to your application and the application infrastructure where user wants to use Oracle Management Cloud to monitor the health and performance of the application. Second is how early warning and machine learning capability of OMC help a customer to identify end user issues quickly and then the administrators, developers, IT operation, DevOps guys can quickly isolate the problem seamlessly going from end user problem to the underlying infrastructure matrix and the logs. Let's log on into Oracle Management Cloud. Here we see all these different services integrated to each other. We are going to start with a dashboard. Here we see a variety of dashboards. Again, these dashboards could be built-in dashboards. These dashboards could be custom dashboards. So this is a custom dashboard that we have built. Let's click on this. So this is a custom dashboard for an application that provides complete visibility to application performance, health of the components and infrastructure. So if you see on the right hand side we have the data coming from the APM part like we have the request by the Tomcat server so we have the infrastructure level metrics in the bottom like docker container load balancer etc so on the left hand side you see business matrix a number of orders mined from the logs average order size again application is uploading the data via the rest API so Oracle management cloud provides the complete visibility to the application by leveraging application performance matrix infrastructure matrix logs business matrix etc again you can customize this dashboard by adding your favorite matrix. This is the global context bar. At the top, we have selected the order app. This allows the users to carry the application context and the time context between the pages. While I'm doing this use cases, we will carry this order app context from dashboard to other pages. So let's click on this global context icon and maximize this. So this is a simple application that has several Tomcat servers. It is load balanced by a Oracle traffic director, which talks to the clustered Oracle databases, these two instances, and those connected to two instances of ASM storage. These Tomcat run on Linux host and the payment gateway run on IS that talks to the SQL server. All these hosts are connected to a network switch. The topology clearly shows that this ASM instance is down. The application is still running fine because we have redundancies in the app. This topology is interactive in nature. You can click on the system component and the association to view the details. Like for example, I'm clicking on this load balancer, which shows that this is up since June 20th. We can also click on the association between the entity. It also shows the key metrics of my host. Here we are looking at the CPU metrics of my server, which is called an entity card, which gives you a quick look at the health of the specific entity. It provides you the basic matrix, how it is going in terms of logs. If you want to look at the particular entity in detail, you can always click on this view entity in data explorer. So what we are seeing is it provides the complete visibility to your application. So let's close this uh, global context window and let's go to the second use case, which shows how early warning and machine learning capability of Oracle Management Cloud can help a customer identify an end user issue quickly and then go to the logs to quickly isolate the problem seamlessly. So Oracle Management Cloud generates early warning alerts based on the anomalies or the thresholds that we can leverage to diagnose issues before end users that are severely impacted. So if you see here, there are some open alerts in this dashboard. Let's drill down into this. So there is an open alert on the Ajax performance for this order app application. So let's investigate the performance of this checkout Ajax call and diagnose the issue. So when I click onto this alert, it takes me to that particular Ajax call that is having a problem. So here we are leveraging the anomaly detection and the baseline learning capabilities of Oracle Management Cloud. So when we drill down into this, we see some anomalies period here in this piece of puzzle. Again, all these graphs are very, very interactive. If I put my mouse here, so it shows that what is exactly is the max response time, average response time, what time it occurred, what date it occurred, etc. So let's go into the geography tab 
and see from where exactly the data is coming from. In our case, the data is coming from the Africa region. We can even see what type of browser is being used by the user, what OS is being used. So now I need to check what is the UI component is hooked up at the server side. So I click on the server request. I see it is hooked up to this checkout servlet, which is a piece of Java technology. So when I drill down into this server request, I see a nicely built call tree map which shows how this servlet is built. So this call tree is generated by OMC automatically using our multiple variable correlation, which is again one of our machine learning capabilities. So what that means is in case if something changes in our application, so this call tree changes automatically. So when I login the next time our monitoring will keep up to the ongoing change so let's click on the instances tab and click on one of the instances that is having a fault so here we see a call tree this is good for developers because they can get the information that this error is occurring at which level of code we can even drill down to the snapshot timeline and check where exactly is the error? Is the error at the DB level or the network level or the IO level, etc. In this use case, in this troubleshooting scenario, I want to know the root cause. And most of the time, the answer is in the logs. So I click on this view related logs. So what OMC does is it grabs only the logs that is associated with this particular incident and at this particular time. So we can do this because all of our data is stored in a unified big data platform. So there might be tons of logs, but when I'm troubleshooting, I want the relevant logs. So now when when we are troubleshooting this problem, we are looking at around 3,800 log entries. So it is very hard for humans to go through each and every log entry and try to find the root cause. So what we would be doing is we would be using machine learning capability called clustering of Oracle Management Cloud to get to the root cause. So when I click on this clustering, what it has done is it has divided those 3800 log entries into 58 human readable patterns. So I'm able to find out the root cause using the machine learning capability of Oracle Management Cloud. So again, based on the findings, I have found out there are 14 potential issues so actually a fault is triggered on purpose at the order service delivery component which is part of Apache Tomcat Catalina logs which is causing a problem we can click on outliers to find out if there is any outliers here so here we are having around three outliers so with this Oracle management cloud we are able to find out the root cause, the needle in the haystack. So this would have taken days to weeks to do in a traditional scenario. So this completes the first part of the cross-platform capability of Oracle Management Cloud. Thanks for watching.